school homie squad it's your boy homie ziggy we back here with another one and hey today we here with pat god leech sniper wolf diss track official music video now hold on let me show myself but look now i may be a little bit late to this to be specific this dropped on uh, this dropped like what two weeks ago october 20 2nd 2023 so yeah this dropped like two weeks ago and what can i say but if you know about how sniper wolf is let's just say with the whole well i would want to say scandal but it ain't scandal it's true if y'all if y'all for those who do know sniper wolf yeah let's face it she is not a good person <laughs> Well, I could say she's not a good person. Maybe I, me personally, I don't know her like that. But let's be honest. The many things that surrounds her and such, with scandal after scandal, one in particular, which is most recent, and that she doxed a person, a guy named Jack Films and such. And yeah, let's just face it, the internet community. <laughs> I would consider myself like that, but it is what it is. Would I consider? I don't know. But yeah, let's face it. She has this reputation of being such corny, cringy, and such. So, and especially with the likes, of, especially with what she's doing and such, doxing somebody. And if you don't know what doxing means, basically to send like internet threats or so something like that i don't condone it but it, look the point is nobody likes sniper wolf <laughs> so with pat god if you know about pat god whenever he did releases a diss track on somebody he be going insane on it so we better check this out make sure you like comment and subscribe follow me on all my socials up there and without further ado let's get to packing Hello. That was another thing too she that was another thing that made her such a bad person right there like there was at one point where this as you saw what he said where hold on let me see if i can pause like right here where where he says ghost the little kid with cancer man your ass should be ashamed right here as you see with the messages and such there was this girl obviously like you hear him say but she had cancer and one of her and i think she was part of like this make a wish foundation something like that y'all let me correct me down in the comments below because this is what i'm going off from my memory and such where it was a girl who had cancer and one of her like dreams or so one of her favorite youtube counter tube internet content creators to meet and such was sniper wolf and the mom tried to want to set it up for her, but she, but Sniper Wolf keep on rejecting her almost every time, sorry, every time and such. And so as you see here where it says, hey, K hey, Kiara, hey, Kiara is up. I don't know if you're around. Hey, sorry, won't be home. Another two hours might be too late. You can try, keep trying. Yes, I use and look, this is where, like, come on now. It don't take you like 10 minutes or so it takes it don't take you like at least 10 or 5 minutes to meet somebody whose dying wish is to meet you as your as their favorite celebrity you can say in a way and she and this mom straight up destroyed her with this saying about you know my daughter looks up to you she loves you watches you watched you her whole career over sorry career her whole cancer treatment 
the past year, it would have been nice for you to just say hi. Right? Just saying hi. Nothing, nothing less. It's okay. It's okay. She's dying and literally has days to live. Just, I just tried to make my daughter's last wishes happen. You shouldn't have even reached out because then I could have just told Kira we tried. I told you, bitch. I told her I wanted to say hi. And instead, you a dying 10 year old girl days. It's all, yeah. That's basically what she did. She kept on talking about trying and trying and trying. But you can, no matter what, it's basically like this. If I'm a celebrity, no matter what's going in my day, somebody wants me to, if a kid who has like their last dying wish and such, right? And I'm a celebrity and if they want to see me, I'm literally pausing whatever I'm doing. Don't know, don't care how important it is. And making sure I fulfill the kid's last dying wishes. Simple as that. It don't take you any five to ten minutes or hell. Give it, give it your entire day for that matter. If you don't have nothing planned for that day, give the child your entire day. Because I know I would. So yeah. For her to do that, ghost a t not only just ghost a 10-year-old kid, a dying 10-year-old kid. That's messed up. On so many levels. And she knows that. But apparently she doesn't. Just a call. Hey. Zero efforts in your work like Mordecai and Ripley. Rigby. Hey man, why you had to put reg regular shit? No, here's the difference though. At least with them two niggas. They can actually put in some work. See? She don't. And you know what's so crazy? YouTube. Li YouTube. YouTube literally demonetized her whole content. And even her second channel. So yeah. At least even if they're not trying to get her off the platform. At least that's the one thing we can agree with. At least demonetizing her work. So that way she's not getting no money off of it. So in a way. That's the little things that matter, so hey, it is what it is. She really does put in zero passions, literally. And I know, look, I know I'm. Oh, for all who's who are saying, dude, why you keep on doing this? Just, dude, I'm reacting. Look here, for those who have that type of comments, the original song to this is in the description. The original link to this is in the description. You can go click it out there. But yeah, it's basically like this, y'all. I know y'all yeah, probably going to watch other video. If you've watched other videos of mine and you see me having the same shirt every single day, just rest assured, it's every single, it's almost every day and such. So. If I like the shirt that I wear, it's just the shirt, and plus it's a shirt. But with her, she would, it's basically like this. She would literally, this is how lazy her work is. And I haven't, I'm not watching none of her stuff, but right. But for all those who's making videos on her, in each thumbnail you might see, right? Because you know, with a thumbnail, you're always going to see the person and what they're wearing and such. Literally, her thumbnail, almost every single one of them, is basically like this. This is how lazy her work is. In one of, on her second channel that she has, right? She is literally posting videos that she posted five years ago. Because I saw it on somebody, on a, com what was it, a commentary channel, if I'm not mistaken, it was called, they're called, he's called Sensitive Society. Literally showed like a clip where she has two videos. They're both the same, but the difference is one is from currently this year and such, and the other one 
is from 2017. It's the same video, but the year is so different. She posting something that was five years ago, recent. That's how lazy her work is. So yeah, for those who want to complain about how want to see me always wearing the same old shirts and whatnot and such but at least i put effort into my content you having somebody releasing something that was five years ago come on now that don't say laziness i don't know what does <laughs> yeah i'm getting up your pass Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Zero fraction. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he literally packed her up for shit sure cuz literally Well, where, where's the lie? I want y'all to tell me where's the lie cuz if there's the lie Let me know as I know damn well one thing he said in there was no lie whatsoever She literally doing all of that ish and her fan base is five-year-olds and obese people that's why his was that's why in that picture he's hey it is what it is <laughs> but you look this is kind of like my first time reacting to pat god not to say first time watching him but first time reacting to him so i'm reacting close it though close though Hopefully y'all not saying I'm rude, because I know some of y'all gonna say that. But either way, y'all let me know what y'all thought about this down in the comments below. Obviously, I don't. It's not even a question if I should ask this or not. He definitely packed her up. But either way, y'all let me know what y'all thought about this down in the comments below. Check out my other reaction right up there, and follow me on all my socials up there, because the same way how I'm trying to reach 2K here. I'm trying to reach at least 1k on my social media so go subscribe to my, my both follow me on my instagram and my twitter up there but either way it's been your boy homo ziggy signing out stay positive keep the vibes up there you go